weekly update on the 90 gallon planet aquarium added from my quarantine tank the uh, diamond head tetras there's five uh, this is round two with the diamond head tetras previous videos showed where I ordered a dozen or 15 or 18 of them and they got wiped out in less than 48 hours back then uh, I don't really know what happened it could have been the pH could have been the water quality round two what's different using RODI water and these have been quarantined uh, and grown out. They're feeding really well. I quarantined them for about 30, 45 days or so. I definitely want more of them. We'll see how these guys do. And let's see here. The other fish was... These are actually Tetris also. That small guy right there. Uh, they're mainly a bottom dwelling tetra. I'll put the name in the description below. Um, I believe I had originally eight or nine of them. I think I'm down to four or five that made it through the quarantine process. Uh, I need to add another Diamond Tetra, which is right there in the center. It has the sparkles on the skin. They call it the Diamond Tetra. Versus those that look like neons, but they're actually called Diamond Head Tetras. Temperature and pH wise, I am at 82.5, 82.9, 6.58. As you can tell, I am draining the tank, and my AquaClear 110 is about to start drawing air. That's why it's making so much noise. Be right back. There's one back there. For some reason, he got really skinny. Some of them did that. Some of them were feeding really well. This discus, unfortunately, is not growing as fast as the other ones. Still need to get one more discus for a total of five because they do have a pecking order when it comes to eating and this one is having to fight really hard and is usually the last one to get any of the food. Uh, let's see. Nice shot of the diamond head tetras. Five of them. There's a big guy. All right. Thanks for watching. Welcome new subscribers. And if you haven't already done so, please subscribe. Updates come out usually weekly. And 
stay tuned for the next update.